Are you tired of that dreaded not enough storage message popping up when you're just about to dive into your favourite movie or download that awesome new app? It's a total buzzkill, right? Well, today I'm here to let you in on a little secret that will absolutely revolutionise your Fire TV Stick 4K Max experience. We're going to show you how to expand your storage and say goodbye to those frustrating storage limitations once and for all. Get ready to unlock the full potential of your streaming powerhouse. This little fire stick is packing hidden potential. We're going to unlock storage you didn't even know was possible. And do you know what the absolutely best part is? You don't need a tech degree to make it happen. Seriously, if you can plug things in, you're already halfway there. We're going to break it down step by easy step. So grab your Fire Stick 4K Max, gather a couple of inexpensive gadgets, and let's get started on this storage upgrade. You'll need a few key items and you'll find links to all of these items on Amazon in the description and pinned comment below. So you'll need your Amazon Fire TV 4K Max, obviously, an OTG, which stands for on the go cable or adapter. Make sure it has a female USB, a male micro USB connector and a female micro USB port for power. And you'll need an external USB storage device. This can be a USB flash drive, 32 gigabytes or larger is recommended, or a portable SSD. The faster the drive, the better your overall experience will be. Now, before we get physical, let's talk brains. There's a really important step we need to cover to make sure this storage expansion works the way we want it to, especially if your goal is to install more apps. This method of using external storage as internal storage for more apps is primarily for newer Fire TV devices running Fire OS 7 or above. This includes the Fire TV Stick 4K Max, the standard Fire TV Stick 4K and the Fire TV Cube. Older Fire TV devices with a Fire OS below 7 can still use external storage, which is awesome for stashing photos and videos. Think of it as extra luggage space, but you won't have the option to install apps directly onto the external drive. So how do you check which Fire OS version your device is running? It's super easy. From your Fire Stick home screen, navigate to settings, then scroll down and select My Fire TV. Then select About. Here, you'll find information about your Fire TV device, including the Fire OS version. Take a quick look and see what it says. If your Fire OS version is 7 or higher, then you're good to go and will have the option to format your external storage as internal storage for installing more apps, just like we're about to do. However, if your Fire OS version is below 7, just be aware that you'll likely only be able to use the external drive for general file storage. The steps for connecting the hardware are still the same, but the formatting options and app installation capabilities will be different. So take a quick moment to check your Fire OS version. This will help you understand exactly how you'll be able to utilize that extra storage. Now let's get back to connecting the hardware. Completely unplug your Fire Stick from both the TV's HDMI port and the power adapter. This is crucial for safely connecting the new hardware. Plug the male micro USB connector of your OTG cable or adapter into the micro USB port on your Fire Stick. Now plug your USB drive or SSD into the female USB port on your OTG cable or adapter. 
plug the original Fire Stick power adapter into the female micro USB on the OTG cable. This makes sure your Fire Stick and the external drive have enough power to function correctly. Now plug your Fire Stick 4K Max back into your TV's HDMI port and let it power on. If you're using a Fire Stick running an older version that is less than Fire OS 7, here's the point in the process where you stop. You won't be able to see or access the USB drive from within the Fire Stick settings. Instead, you should be able to open a File Explorer app like Explore to see and manage files on your USB drive. If it doesn't, then use the clickable sections to jump to the troubleshooting tips section in this video. Once your Fire Stick running Fire OS 7 or above powers back on, keep an eye out for a notification. It might pop up letting you know a new USB drive has been detected. Now, if you don't see that notification right away, don't worry. Simply navigate to settings on your Fire Stick's home screen, then scroll down and select My Fire TV. On the next screen, you should see your connected USB drive listed. Now go ahead and select it. What you see next depends on how your USB drive is currently formatted. If it's already in a format that your Fire TV understands, like FAT32, your Fire Stick will recognise it as general storage. This is great for easily transferring your photos, videos and other files between your Fire Stick and a computer. Think of it as a digital suitcase. However, keep in mind that in this mode, you won't be able to install apps directly to this drive. You'll likely only see an option here to format to internal storage. If your USB drive isn't in a compatible format, you'll probably see two formatting choices. Format to internal storage. Now this is the golden ticket for massively boosting your app storage, which I'm guessing is why you're here. Choosing this will completely wipe everything on your USB drive, so double check you've backed up anything important. Once you hit go, your Fire Stick will treat this external storage like it's part of its own brain, giving you tons of room for all those apps and games. The other choice you'll see is format to external storage. If your main goal is just to easily transfer files between your Fire Stick and other devices, this is your pick. Once the formatting is complete, your Fire TV Stick 4K Max will have significantly more space for all your apps, games and downloads. You can now install more without constantly worrying about running out of room. Okay, tech hiccups happen. What if you've plugged everything in, but your USB drive is playing hide and seek in the My Fire TV menu? Well, don't sweat it, let's troubleshoot. First things first, the classic tech fix. Unplug your USB drive from the OTG cable, give it a few seconds, and then plug it back in firmly. Sometimes that's all it takes to wake things up. If it's still not showing up, the next thing we're going to check is the format of your USB drive. Your Fire Stick generally plays best with the FAT32 file system for initial recognition. If your drive is formatted differently, like NTFS or XFAT, the Fire Stick might not see it. In this case, you might need to format your USB drive to FAT32 using a computer manually. It sounds a bit technical, but it's usually a straightforward process. I've created a separate, easy to follow video guide that walks you through exactly how to format a USB drive to FAT32. I'll leave a direct link to that video down in the description below. And that's all there is to it. You've successfully expanded the storage on your Fire Stick 4K Max. 
No more deleting apps just to try out something new. You've unlocked a whole new level of Fire TV freedom. Remember to check the links in the description below for recommendations on OTG cables, adapters, and reliable USB storage devices that work great with the Fire TV Stick 4K Max. If you found this video helpful and you're finally saying goodbye to storage woes, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe for more awesome Fire Stick tips and tricks and let me know in the comments how much extra storage you added to your device.